Welcome to Lavanya's Computer Classes. In this video, I will give some important questions. So, specially for JNTUH R22, that is also for ECE students. ECE that is C programming for engineers. So, unit, unit wise, I will give the important questions. Almost all PPS and oh, civil engineering students, for EC students, everything is oh, C language only. Topics are some topics are common in different different units, but specially I made I made this video for oh, ECE student that is also C programming for engineers. Unit one, the questions are first question is oh, what is memory? Define memory. Explain the different types of memory. Very very important question. Next one is what is input and output devices and uh, explain various input and output devices. These all are the essay type questions. Same questions are coming for short answer questions also or define memory. It is like a short answer question. Define memory, explain different types of memories means it is a long answer question. So, students are not necessary to worry about which type of questions are coming for uh, short answers or uh, long answers. If you read the concept, then automatically you are able to write either it is a short answer or long answer questions. What is input device? That is a short answer question. Different types of input devices with examples, SI type question. Similarly, what is an output? What are list some different types of output devices? That is short answer question. Second one is what is a storage device? Explain primary and secondary storage devices. Important question. Or sometimes they are asking only explain different types of primary storage devices. That is also short answer question. Define operating system like short answer question or explain different types of operating systems. SI type question. Next explain the functions of operating system. Important question. And what is an algorithm? Define or explain algorithm, flowchart, pseudocode with examples. Define an algorithm, define flowchart, define param pseudocode and what is a flowchart, what are the different symbols are used in flowchart that is also coming questions. Next what is the difference between compiler, interpreter, assembler, differences between these three are define compiler, short answer question, define interpreter, define assembler. Next one is define loader, define linker. So these are the unit 1 questions, chapter 1. Next one is explain the structure of C program with example, explain it. Next explain how to create and write execute a C program, what are the steps are involved for executing a C program. Next one is what is an error, explain the different types of errors or sometimes they are asking explain about syntax errors, explain about logical errors. Next these all are the <coughs> SI type questions. Data type, what is a data type? Explain the different types of data types. What is a variable? How to give an a variable or what are the rules are used for a variable? Next one is what is a constant? Explain the different types of constants. Very, very important questions. And storage classes. What is storage class? Explain the different types of storage classes. Remember here storage classes are very, very, very important question. I will give you in the end of the this day video, I will explain some more important questions in this storage class is also one of the very, very important question. Next one is unit 2. In the unit 2, the concepts are expressions and statements. First one is short answers question like what is operand and what is an operator? Already I done so many videos um, in my channel. Just go uh, my playlist and write only PPS or C programming. These all videos are available. Take it from that. My channel and what is an expression, how to evaluate expressions using different operators. With a numerical example, you can explain this one. What is precedence? Explain. Explain about associativity with examples. Type conversion, here this is also very, very important question. Here storage class is one question. Type conversion, second one more very important question. Type conversion or type casting. Next, what is a statement? Explain about simple and compound statements with examples. With examples. Next one, these are very important questions. What is a conditional statement? Conditional statement either if, if else statements, nested if statements with example programs. Everything, these all concepts are explained with example programs. If means 
biggest of two numbers biggest of two numbers biggest of three numbers given number is even or odd these all are the important questions if statements nested if student nested if student uh, program is uh, take the student details then find first class second class third class a division of a student that is important for nested if statement next explain dangling else problem else statement next one is multi conditional statement or switch statement what is a st switch statement or explain the multi conditional statement both are same next one is explain about break and continue statements with example program next one is what is a loop explain the different types of loops for loop while loop do while everything explain with uh, what is the loop statement syntax and example program so which example program are important for for loops means factorial of a given number fibonacci series sum of the individual digits gcd of two numbers or lcm of two numbers given number is prime or not reverse of a given number and palindrome program already this program already said in previous so these all are the very very important programs using for loop and while loop statements next one is these are the unit 2 questions now unit 3 the unit 3 questions are chapters are functions and arrays important concepts define function explain the different types of functions use are defined functions built in functions and what are the advantages and need of functions and explain some built in functions explain built in functions built in functions means either it is a mathematical functions string functions string functions are coming separately in one more or in next unit also so mathematical functions and what are the passing parameter techniques in functions very important call by value method call by reference method swapping of two numbers using call by value or call by reference very very important questions these two next one is passing arrays to functions what is a recursion function explain with an example program very 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 important question and for this example program we learn factorial of a given number using fact recursion fibonacci series using recursion or gcm and lcd of two numbers using recursion next what is an array explain different types of arrays with examples with syntax and examples how to declare and initializing the values of an array next difference between string and character arrays for short answer questions it is also important next one is explain about string input output functions explain string manipulation functions string length string reverse string copy string cat this everything is string manipulation functions very important question next unit 4 pointers and file handling simple topics what is a pointer how to declare a pointer explain the different types of pointer applications dynamic memory allocation very very important question the previously i already said one is the storage classes type conversion then third con third question is dynamic memory allocation read it properly next how to use pointers in self referential structures next what is a file explain the different types of files and in this only file modes very very important question file modes file input and output functions see see pre processor directives this is also very important question and in this file handling only there are three important programs one is how to create create then write the information and read read the information from the file that is one thing second program is copy the content of one file into another file that is another copy the files and third one is merging two files these three programs are very very important in the files read all these three programs next one is what is macros explain about macros and command line argument this is also very important questions okay this is a unit for questions and last unit that is a unit 5 structures what is a structure how to define and initialization and accessing the elements of a structure same thing if you read structures automatically unions are coming because only thing is 
just instead of str you see destruct we are using union remaining everything is same what is union how to initialize and declare the values into the union difference between structure and unions important question if you read these two questions automatically you can write third question explain about enumeration data type important question next one is searching techniques i prepare i kept so many videos about searching and sorting read it carefully searching what is a searching explain different types of searching techniques that means linear search and binary search with program numerical example sometimes they are asking difference between linear and binary search also which search technique is better compared to these two next what is sorting explain the different types of sorting techniques bubble sort insertion sort selection sort with example programs and then numerical solving problems what these algorithms what is the roots of write an algorithm for roots of a quadratic equation calculate the order of the complexity either o notation big o notation everything so these are the important questions in all these important questions some questions are already said what are the questions type casting type casting enumeration data type pre processors dynamic memory allocation dynamic memory allocation storage classes these are very very important questions in these five questions compulsory any two questions are coming from command line arguments one more is command line arguments command line arguments these all are the six questions one 2 3 4 5 6 if you read these six questions perfectly with examples with syntaxes compulsory 2 to 3 questions are coming into your final examination pattern like examination paper similarly recursion recursion program is very very important functions next arrays arrays read the arrays concepts next one is files very simple thing what is a file different types of files file modes and then a uh, programs using files string handling functions are important then uh, data types data types operators constants are important operators constants and general questions are what is memory important memory operating systems input and output devices what is algorithm flow chart and then pseudo code if you read uh, like this these concepts these are all are very very important then we have to write all the questions without leaving any question so read all these questions according to how i am saying what i am saying so then automatically we are getting very good marks so all the best read all the questions carefully and with programs also and uh, inform to your friends please subscribe my channel read all right all the all the questions all the best thank you for watching my video please subscribe my channel thank you